In previous bite sizes, we've talked about using this thin strip jig to cut repeatable thin strips. If you're like me and like to make tools, this is the way to go. If you want something quicker without spending time making tools, there's a quicker way. We'll make this little jig that sits next to your blade. The one I'm gonna show you is about three inches wide, but you can make yours as wide or as narrow as you want. You'll want the length of yours to be longer than your blade. My blade is 10 inches, so I'll make mine about 11. We'll square up a piece of stock on the table saw so that when we use a square with it, it's a perfect 90. Now we'll grab one of these thin steel rulers and cut it off at the width of our jig. Add a little epoxy or Loctite super glue and have the numbers start from zero and move away from the blade. Now to use it, it needs to be pushed up against the blade. Line your stock up, move the jig and you're good to go. We'll add a couple magnets to the top of the jig that will allow us to store it on the side of the table saw. Sub and follow for more bite-sized tips. Keep making things.